Good morning, good people. Mark Holmes here, and as always, I want to say thank you all for watching, commenting, subscribing, and being part of the Joe Boo Sports Report. Without you guys, as well as you ladies, you know that this literally does not work. I hope everybody's having a great Sunday. Don't forget, 5 o'clock Eastern, we'll have our Zoom call. Uh, channel members, I'll put the link in the description, excuse me, in the community tab, so that way you guys can join us here at the Red Brick House. We are working and getting things done. My son, Michael Anthony Fitness Reaction Gig Economy Electrician Extraordinaire is getting the final electrical stuff hooked up and ready to rock and roll here at the house. Me, I am, of course, sitting here doing what I also do, YouTube. So we have um, some pissed off players. Pissed off players. Austin Eckler set up for last night a Zoom call. Excuse me. Sorry, I was up late last night. Zoom call for all big time running backs. Because basically, the franchise tag. What? Was Zeke on that call? I don't know if Zeke was or not. <laughs> we'll find out. But Josh Jacobs, as well as Saquon, and shout out to Rashid who called us because he misses us and said, I'm just wrong for talking about his team. I said, um, Rashid. Did I lie but he also about said, your team? He also said you were correct about his team. That's so I if, I, if I didn't lie about him, where's the problem? He's like, I don't want to be reminded that we're team, right, my team's going to be ass this year. I, that's basically his premise. I don't think they're going to get ass. Be that as it may. Be that as it may. We'll have to wait and see if that's the case where his team is ass-ass or not. I, I'm kind of thinking that it might be. But regardless of his team being ass-ass, Running backs are getting no love whatsoever. We know the running backs are getting no love. And I don't know that there's much that they can do about it. Now, we have Saquon talking about holding out. He's considering that for the season. Uh, Josh Jacobs, neither of them signed their franchise tag. Um, which, And you see that the Giants have signed another running back just in case. So it's getting ugly, and it's sad because no position. It used to be running back was up there with quarterback. In fact, in some cases, you could look and say Jim Brown. Jim Brown was the greatest player during his generation. Rest in peace. Okay? Uh, exactly. Rest in peace. Now, they are literally getting crapped on, spit on, left on the side of the road and gives nobody gives any thought to them whatsoever um i don't know that that's going to change because the position has devolved because players when you think of saquon who's had injury issues great player when he's healthy but if you put all your eggs in the basket of saying you know we're a running team and you lose that running back you're screwed because you don't have enough money to pay two great running backs. So that's just a mess. Now, moving on to our Dallas Cowboys, everything is still quiet. I'm betting that the tractor trailers of Dallas Cowboys stuff, got this lace all over my mic, um, Dallas Cowboys gear, if it's not already in Oxnard, the tractor trailers are on their way. I'm betting that the gray lady, the bus, is on its way to Oxnard, too. So when Jerry gets there, they're ready to rock and roll. Training camp, y'all, is here. And this Sunday, ladies, ladies, I hate to tell you, it's time to be a football widow again. Football season, the custom of it is here. I have a lot of faith in my Dallas Cowboys this year. Call me crazy, if you will. Call me everything else. But I think the Cowboys are about to do some really good things. So, we got nothing. Seriously, we got nothing really. Nothing big. Nothing other than Zach Martin wants more money. Um, Catboy is being Catboy. And, uh, you know, holding on to the dineros. Uh, Zeke, 
is not a Dallas Cowboy. Dak Prescott is still under the microscope and, of course, doubted as always. Um, did I miss anything, Mike? Really, that's it. Oh, Mike McCarthy's on the hot seat because he's a bum coach, <laughs> along with Dak Prescott being a bum-ass quarterback. And um, Cowboys being overrated, as always. That's it. That and I have a house to finish. So I've got my floor taken up over here. I would want to get it put back down, wouldn't I? It has a lot of trips. Trips? You mean falls through the ceiling? Yeah, so there's that. In case you're wondering what we're talking about. Um, I'm trying to level up. Um, you're going to get the... How does the floor... Does that mount on the, the floorboard? He's got the hole in the hole. Okay, so I need to... Okay, so you don't need to do that while I'm gone and get the lumber. No, no, no. Once you put the floorboards down, it's cut the hole, and you put the wire okay. through it, through the box. It's a square box. I'm tired today, y'all. I don't know if you noticed that. I was so, hours last night. And we, what time did we leave here last night? Midnight? No, it was like 11 o'clock. Or after 11. Yeah, we've had some long days here. Mm. That's a long day. I'm not the job, too, so you're not home. But you know, when you're lazy, you're just sitting around doing nothing, and everybody else does all the work. So, I'll show you what we're doing here. Mike's doing the fire, final wiring over there on that. I have, this is kind of interesting. <laughs> this framework that's in here. Not real good. I've got to go get some lumber to redo that. They use a sign, it looks like, over here. Or wallpaper or something. Oh, that's a sign. I'm going to take that out. Um, like the same wallpaper they used before. I've got to. I got to reframe this over here so that way um, when I put my boards down, they'll be leveled and sturdy because I ain't trying to have anybody fall through the ceiling. Just not. All right, good people. It's coming along. It's getting there. And uh, yesterday, we were a lot further away. Today, we'll be closer. Tomorrow, will be even closer, closer. So... Have a great day, and I will stand. And as Philly would say, don't be a dingbat. Peace.